Hello everyone, uh, welcome to the series of success story talks where we ask our students who got trained through us and successfully got placed to come and share their excitement and their learning experiences. Today we have Sugumar with us. Uh, Sugumar, it is glad and it, it is really a proud moment for us, right? Someone with certain challenges can also scale those challenges and become a successful, uh, you know, uh, employee to get started with. But I wish you all the success. You also have the potential to become an entrepreneur is what I feel, uh, Sugumar. Thank you. Uh, so would you like to introduce yourself, Sugumar, for the sake of our audience? Sure, sure, Barani. Uh, hi, all. Uh, this is Sugumar. I'm 23 years old. I'm from Chennai. Uh, I graduated in 2023. Uh, after that, uh, I was in my third year. I got a two offer letter from my own company. Uh, first company name is Wipro, second name is uh, Sutherland. That time I decided like, uh, I want to choose my specific domain instead of going uh, whatever I get. That's why like uh, I started this journey. I'm a keyboardist as well. I'm very really interested in music, listening music and playing music. That's it. Wonderful, wonderful, Sukumar. So, how was your journey with 360 Digit MJ while you were learning? And what kind of challenges did you face in the initial days? Uh, I understand the limitations that you have, but what kind of challenges you face? See, you are an inspiration for everyone. Okay. At least for me, you are an inspiration, right? Thank you. Thank so, you. I, but I want you to share that uh, those challenges with the wider audience so that everyone gets motivated. Yes, Baron. Actually, my thing is, um, I studied in my uh, Hilton matriculation school. Uh, in my 14th, 15th age, I started to lose my eye, eyesight, like due to RP condition. After that, uh, the in my school time, I'm not much serious. Like, uh, just study, get at least average, at least 80 to 85. That's it. I could convince my parents. That it, that's it. After that, I re realized, okay, I want to do something. Uh, I want to create some value in my life. I want to build something. That that's why I choose IT. Uh, after I decided IT, uh, I realized accessibility. Like uh, I'm using screen reader. Uh, it is called NVIDIA Non Visual Desktop Access. It is converting all screen objects into audio. That that is a screen reader. Uh, if I want to explore uh, any image uh, materials. I couldn't do that. This is my first uh, problem. In my college time, I didn't explore any accessible material, but uh, my grade is 8.2 in CGPA. Somehow I managed to get that my parents support uh, and my friends support. When I uh, reached 360 digit MG, before that I uh, research about it. I want to do AI, which uh, institute I have to choose. Uh, I had a multiple option, then I contact uh, career counselor uh, my career counselor is shiva i contacted him then i asked him i am visually challenged uh, do you allow me to study here that time uh, he said i don't know i'll ask my manager then uh, he contacted sudha uh, sudha i think sudha connected with you i think then uh, i met you then that time i didn't uh, get opportunity to speak with you but you said like uh, we are happy to uh, hear uh, to help you really thank you uh, for that barani then you s told me i'll give you free wavering fee sorry course wavering fee that time i i i, I feel like i'm blessed uh, really uh, first time technology i don't know how to explore those area second thing is money money is uh, that time i got got money from my parents i had a money exactly how i could afford in that pds program I somehow got into that be, uh, be, because of you then i realized i explored multi multiple things and all how could i learn mathematics how could i learn codings i'm familiar with codings but uh, our programming python those are little bit different I don't know how to do that. Then I explore multi multiple uh, resources. Uh, for example, Andrew, Andrew NG, one of the Stanford professors. 
i explored that multiple things now i familiar with all those concept i confident enough to crack the interview wonderful wonderful and how was your experience with respect to internship because you also have done internship with us you worked on a few of the real world projects how was that experience and how did that actually help you in cracking the interview if you may share some right yeah. yes correct uh, before that uh, i cleared multiple interviews uh, i don't know may i uh, mention those company names yeah, but, yeah please please go ahead yeah. mention that okay. uh, that company name is 3k technologies is a bangalore based company and uh, eg innovations but uh, they are say as a startup we couldn't afford uh, you that's why i left that company then i reach out to you uh, please uh, i am facing this kind of issue then you offer me internship uh, l- that last three months i feel like uh, i worked on more than 6 7 tasks i like building projects from the scratch i it, it, th- that experience helped me to crack the interview really they asked me in the interview they are asking me what is the pipeline you uh, built before and what is your architecture of that project i explain end to end they impressed uh, that uh, knowledge i got from the internship ai spray internship wonderful and which company are you joining suma uh, recently i joined brilla soft uh, limited brilla soft limited wonderful. as a ai analyst wonderful. wonderful and uh, i'm i'm really happy and extremely glad that we are having this conversation and you will remain an inspiration to a lot of people because a lot of people who are really capable also start looking out for reasons on whom to blame and how to blame for they not getting a job right but you reversed uh, the entire scenario you never blamed anyone okay for whatever has happened uh for the i said that you have lost uh, since your 14 15 years and uh, you never blamed anyone you stood up to the challenge and your perseverance and hard work your yes, relentless hard work uh, i i feel like people uh, i i heard one uh, quote actually if someone blame others they are long way to go uh, if someone blaming themselves they half way to go if someone blame didn't blame anyone they reached their destination that is the thing other thing is if we didn't do anything it's our business it's none of uh, other people business that is my true true absolutely absolutely if you don't do something you are the person who will be negatively impacted not others so stop yeah. blaming start working okay that is what i would say through this uh, success story to each and every person um and all the best sugumar for your future uh, really, i really thank you varani actually uh, i am here because of multiple people help me you are also one of the person you you elevate my uh, professional career really thank you for that uh, that last two years i spend uh, much time in 360 digit mg this is that is my uh, transition time now i am uh, confident enough to uh, deliver my work in my company wonderful wonderful so nice to hear the nice words all the best sugumar for your future and yeah, do stay in touch and be inspiration for many people thank you yeah thank you varun thank you all take care